You're not supposed to be a murderer. All you did. And all you can. Response team. If George Bush told you to, you're not supposed to be. If the devil told you to, you're not supposed to be. If Bob Anderson or Ricky Royho and their playing spiel told you to, you're not supposed to be a devil like respondents or response. An aircraft carrier? No, you're not. And Westminster Police and Bob Anderson don't want to understand what we debriefed, who not to lead and let lead a situation like Bob Anderson is doing with you here and there. And we told you not to do that. We told you to confide in Steve and work with the Steve. And if we know the future is too, and our time travelers also, and we are also TOD words, and you are not Westminster Police Chief Designate, or not, you're not supposed to ask Anderson, or whoever, however, to do tricky. You're not supposed to ask Ricky to come up here and blow it away. You're not supposed to ask Dr. Whoever, however, you became a doctor and how many murders you did to do it, to become unraveled, to lie straightforwardly, and ask them to aid in the bed like you did and are doing, and lying under oath under penalty of tis treason. Tis treason. caught in the act, and I know it too, you don't have to ask Kathy or Ricky or whoever, however, or pretend to be a judge, or just finding out about this, at 24-7, same as you, medical facilities, I don't want to call this, you don't have to snow job me, you don't have to confuse issue, at who woke up who and gave who life and light to see your world today. And every trick in the book that isn't even in the book. You're in the act of no sir instead of affirmative sir. Complaint being given about nebulas missing on account of Sandra Hutchins alone, her inventory of needing to get her yayas by ending everybody else's, by grat gratifying her need to rectal inseminate, ream, rape, kill, a devil like act. You personally are not supposed to be free to go, or him, or Anderson, or the assistant police chief in Westminster, who did this this morning, when calls came in, that we awoke from either the departed or spaceship or unknown regions of you died, and nuked the place up too many times, Anderson will help you. And we asked you not to do those things not to come at Steve and act as if we have Steve not to do, don't do that. At confusing the issue again. At freeze right there. Freeze. In the act. I do have you up and you are caught in the act. You're not really a Navy. You're not really a USA. You're not really an army. You're not really a DOD. All these things I heard. That you're a platform to do every living thing off in creation. And we can't have that. 
and that is affirmative, sir, on your behalf, pay your attorney, hospital, bills. Got that Huntington Hospital, and Westminster Police, Bob Anderson's coffer, West Court, Superior, one at a time. And we are recording for quality assurances. Everything you say can and will be used against you. You have a right to an attorney. If you can or cannot afford one, you have one here present for you, which you didn't afford. So by knowing the situation beforehand, Westminster police chiefs took it upon themselves to dunder, murder all you can, seismanships, and scalpel my German family friend members before and when they arrived here and when a package of assistance arrived as one of hundreds of millions, and they stole my money and our money is directed towards heaven to make. And I know you did, though. On a February, was it the 6th, the 4th, the 7th, the 16th, those times, those areas, this year, 2018, this one alone, aside from Secret Service monies that was stolen. And intercepted by county detention murder terrorist not looking to uphold, protect, preserve, defend anything. But if I ever found out or if you ever got caught so what we need is the treasury money returned Westminster Police Chief, U.S. Treasury money that you divvy out to whoever, however, to end us, along with Telecare, knocka knocka on my door. To be taken into custody and confiscated is not the same thing as the laws that we have. Uh, you there did it too looking for a fight a nuclear bomb to be a quitter and you did that too many times and so when we wake you up from the deceased and the departed only to see nukes away everyday affair and laugh in my face what do you suppose who do you suppose should be upset at who there it is look at it set it up too just so happened that Admiral Flynn was supposed to be a million dollars at ease, not a million dollars at getting reamed and not being sold instead of unsold and so in Richmond. You just, boom! You dared. So, by I am speaking, having the phones on at all times to get that, ask uh, that murder homosexual rear end popper paper piper to misconstrue above presidents security cl presidents clearances above i made you not to pop my butthole or murder me or murder everyone else who do or did the same on account of ricky and other pre-planners like anderson we told you we debriefed not to lead this event and mislead the Westminster police chiefs and others think Obama's the one to follow and I told you not to allow whoever however 
penis in my mouth and rape psych sides and sit monsters or not to lead or mislead to have a nice cheesecake for Stevie to pull aside again we're going to keep going through it over and over and to say to come out of a nice pleasant hibernation or to come out of you're going to get it you can't you make me not want to be mad about it please so the secret service agencies not Glenn Richmond's got other ideas and running like a stuck-eyed coward secret service agencies were supposed to pull garbage like you aside garbage like Glenn Richmond garbage like County whoever they think is the big honcho in charge and not in charge and I did clarify every living thing in creation and Sandra Hutchins one alone need to get her yayas to do nebulas off way back when may not mean Jack Diddley squat to you or him or them or that or this And by unselling and underfunding Admiral Flynn and Steve, like a, like a, 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 not really a police, and police are the worst, not the best, unfortunately. And how do we know that? Well, Steve drew an allegory of 1999 information systems that were made available to administrative and CIA op tops as to the 1999 mystery of how many drums of chemical contaminant warfare ordinance was uh, Iraq holding and Glenn Richmond's got a <laughs> I need to get his cannelloni bluied I'm talking and the information that was made and ratified for administrative ops and CIA op tops was not nearly up to par in an effort to do even them away. And that was our attorney general service and our district attorney service and the police law enforcement personnel assigned to work underneath in an effort to undermine is what they were doing. As, as we have it, to put it in an allegory, a pattern. Oh, yes, there was. Oh, yes, it was. Uh, do you need or did you need any tornadoes? Did you need any hurricanes? Do you need any uh, any uh, tsunamis? Do you need any of that? And you found out a lot. Well, we found out a lot. And we shared a lot. See? So let's not be lame about this. See what I'm saying? I know I catch you in the act. In a combine of soup pure. I'm not going to say gypsy stew soup like that other guy's band and some other. And so you didn't thrash anybody, huh, Steve? I forgot to thrash people. So you got something else you think is a table, huh? So by everybody, or a good percentage, going down to the ground when Steve goes to sleep these days, only to wake a phone call, not to be confused with a simple dance, can bring him back only to see they get hysterical and call the cops and ask the need to, 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 to nuke us again to get nukes away. You think that's funny to do? You think that's something for a coherent and incoherent? Anyone in their right or any kind of reasonable mindset would lie. And so by knowing that my phone is still open to 714-472-0867 number, 
knowing you're on it, and knowing you're a lie, Westminster Huntington Beach, looking for whoever, however, like Kathy would try to do, and we warn you about phony friends, the efforts to make hell, and monsters in disguises, their devils aside to live their lives. I disagree is not what you did. You need to be fully extended to the fullest extent of eye for an eye. And then we'll see how you can act like you're a big disagreeer, pal. Is that fair? Strong arm your way, is it, right? Strong arm your way. So the guilty parties, perpetrators, as to the flagrance of the hour, and the hour's imputes, and note the time and the blatancy of combat. Not that I want to call it that right now. Uh, front lines warfare, no. Obstructing justice and not qualified to do anything to do with anything, but pray to God you don't get the eye for an eye excruciating you deserve wants to say something instead of affirmative sir. That you're not qualified, remember? So by stepping over all the Supreme Court judges way back when to show your little <laughs> and by not giving anything and everything in creed or credence to understood a word called atonement or reproach. <laughs> I'm going to be sending some bills out to you. And this way will bypass the unpleasant cruel finger pointing and an effort to have my staff I need to employ hurry 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 and meet your uh, 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 staff and not necessary lock Loman uh, 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 love 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 we would and that is where we would rather be got that even at lock Loman love 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 Thank you, sir. And that will conclude for now. We'll make it sometimes lesser is more. And more is lesser. So. Ask not what you can do for stupefying and getting back on track. But exactly perpendicular, not but that is to cut the shut to get the do and not get in the way and not knock ah, tell a bold face lie right at my door and see what happens as you dice you think that is to roll and that is what you did and I told you not to do that telecare And take Kathy into custody, please. That's a threat, a death threat try in the act. And whoever, however, thinks that they called it and that they also need to be taken into custody. And that is a no right there, I see. Thank you, sir, Thank you. Thanks, Steve. No, sir, and a death threat try is not something to laugh in my fucking face and make. Got that fucker? You better get the fucking trouble. Quit making trouble and asking Cheney or whoever the fuck you did to stick raw him up my ass and everyone's ass is what you did and are doing here. No, I can't kick his ass. Or even if I know I'm not going to throw him, not going to throw him blows. You're not. 
saw Steve as a toothpick size, and I saw Ansi jumping ship in recent times. I gotta watch out for that, comparatively speaking. So the type of individuals that can work with a Stevie, and not you or them, and doing that instead of that. So you need to disqualify yourself then. It's as I see, I say to do, because you're one of these. So by acting as if nukes away is all you know how to do and all you know how to talk, that is all you did talk. You didn't get on, you know my number. Why isn't my telephone ringing? Huh? Because you don't want to talk things over. You want to threaten and lie. Westminster Police Chief Collins is the perpetrator. To sell or unsell, to note and know and acknowledge or higher rank than yourselves, especially when you disqualify yourselves as many murders and murdered and, and act as if you can walk away and continue and laugh in our face and proceed and continue murdering and screwing whoever you can put a big old sodomy jacket on Stevie about and with for. And that's what you and your murder problems and your murder monsters are doing here. Oh, yes, you did. And people that came back from the resurrection, these people tortured and did hiney hole rape, sexual perversion, detestation so bad and are laughing in our face. Would I want to kill you for that? Huh? To the fullest extent of what that's what telecare is involvement is, and did and does that. That's why do not come to the door and pay the man turn yourself in, especially if you're insisting on getting in the way like you're doing. Now we're going to go to Washington. We're going to go to Washington and we're going to get some others that will decapitate and deflate your efforts over here. Williamsburg too, to never uphold life. And that isn't what I want you to do, is never uphold life. Did I make myself clear? No. So, I never heard a, th a darn thing about it. But I know I check you and I catch you at court. Because I ain't Steve alone and I'm a mind of, my, of, it, in mind of its own over here. And you're a liar looking for a fight. And a very bad, bad, bad indicator and perp perpetrator and abuse, like they are. You too, Jim. You too, Patricia, should exactly that. It, know your name and accountability. And you, you, you want to really go over how bad it is and what you did and still think you can get away with doing at spaceship detention detail. Don't come home anymore and still lying.
I didn't ask you to talk. It's something or someone thinks they have the right to stay in the quadrant and as many in numerical fatalities and casualties that I pointed out as if Sandra Hutchins alone, her tally and her need to get her really a alloy and a lever cock machine in disguise, not a female like you think or thought, Steve, and the you're asking whoever, however, like you are in the act. And I asked you nicely not to lie. No murdering. And you murdered? There's no such thing as real judges. You're supposed to be nice about this and cut to get to get to not go. Let me hide it here. I'm not a murderer. I'm fight about it. At the time, don't say present danger, say affirmative, sir. Especially you gave it up too many times and nuked away, and so don't have it done, get involved anymore. You like to lie all the way, don't you? All of you together. Yeah, but you do and did. <laughs> lie all the way, like you're doing right now. Uh, you're a liar. You're not trying to uh, let me murder you and hurt you and pull a fast one and then call it something else. So by billing uh, your insurer and not going head to toe with these individualities that you give life, very often the case by even bringing their picture forward, not alone just telephone calls. And looking to make a liar out of me every which way you can to kill all the rest of the people in the world, even for sure, for sure, for sure, is all the F-bomb you're about. And so, if I ask you nicely, Mr. Collins, Westminster Police Chief, to pull aside murders like her and they that kill that lie, ask whoever, however, to misconstrue that, like Haddock is doing, did that whoever however can <laughs> f bomb the whole thing like you did do you know you did it you know who I know you are not I do the same thing you're not excused you need to be a dead man I seize that man right there you answered no sir bombs away one too many times. And I say to kill you. You don't think I'm mistaken, do you? To a higher court's accord. That is not a terrorist threat to kill your ass. Or yours, or theirs, or theirs. I say it ain't. But not any old kill. The eye for an eye excruciating that you're making a scene, and I told you not to be making a scene. And for those extra extraordinary circumstances and mitigating factors of your continued effort to set an example of murder all you can, laws, gods, and objections and complaints don't count, these are more than enough reasons of how many you do and continue and say, oh, I'm going to do that instead. See what you did? So it's more than the right to 
suggest and dress advised to a higher court's attention and to the victim's interests that you're a liar and a dead man need to be. But a dead man is just too good for you and people like you. And you, you made them too, Steve. They didn't want you to know that you saw your inventory and your record. And these are run aloof to go murder away. You'd be upset too, huh? Yes, I would. And no, you do not have a double split personality. And yes, you are a liar about a mind of its own and an image that came from a biblical reference of, from thence. So what I would do is ask whoever, however, to behave themselves, refrain from having contact, do not disturb us, do not lie, do not laugh, do not make a mockery. You do not know how to do that. You assault and ask and pick and roll a real bad element to come over here. And I ask you to do that from the bottom to the top. And whoever, however, I said to kill you too, and every one of you, because you murderers asking whoever, however, to misconstrue at selling and sewing. You just. Uh, So you like to have George Bush lie for you. I think that is what holds water and goes, don't you? You did, though. And I told you not to. Even if he voted for George Bush himself, I told the table for which it stood, and you didn't stand, not to. So you're not free to go. You're to turn yourself in, I said. Each and every one of you. That is my find. Next case.